Hi, my name is Mike Wilker. I'm the senior pastor at Church of the Reformation here in Washington, D.C. We're located on Capitol Hill, actually just a couple of blocks from the U.S. Capitol and just one block from the U.S. Supreme Court building. Our congregation was founded in 1869, and um, we're in this building since 1934. And for many years, our congregation um, was seen as one of the white Protestant congregations that was just part of the fabric of official Washington, D.C. Um, in the 1960s, 70s, and 80s, um, our congregation um, opened its doors to the neighborhood and to the nation in some dramatic ways. When um, Martin Luther King Jr. was assassinated in 1968, the congregation opened its doors to the Southern Christian Leadership Conference as they were planning um, what their responses um, should be here in the nation's capital um, after his assassination. And um, in the 1970s, this congregation helped host um, the farmer activists who drove their tractors to Washington, D.C. to protest the um, ways that farmers were being treated in the United States at that time and era. So one way that the congregation provides and does social justice is by providing hospitality and showing solidarity with the people's movements across this country and welcoming them here to Washington, D.C. and helping and encouraging and praying for them as they raise their voices to our representatives here in the Capitol. But not only do we um, open our doors to the nation, we also open our doors to the neighborhood. Um, we have a food pantry here it's the only food pantry on Capitol Hill. Um, we serve about 4,000 people a year, and um, it's entirely funded by uh, donations from members and friends of our congregation. Um, every once in a while, we get a small grant from um, either a government entity or a, a, a foundation, but it's almost otherwise entirely funded by members and friends of our congregation. We also helped found Southeast Ministry, which is an organization that provides basic education uh, and uh, job readiness programs for adults in Southeast DC. It's over by the old St. Elizabeth's Hospital in the Congress Heights neighborhood. And um, in that neighborhood, unlike the neighborhood that we're in next to the Capitol building, but in Southeast DC, unemployment ranges um, over 20% of the adult population. And that's the people who are counted as being unemployed. The actual unemployment figures are probably much higher there. So our congregation, um, again, provides a lot of funding for that organization. It's now a separate 501c3, but the great majority of the board members and leadership at Southeast Ministry are members of Reformation. There's a lot of other things that we do by providing services in our neighborhood and um, by opening our doors to the folks who are here to raise their voices for justice and peace in the nation's capital. Perfect.